back to my channel how you guys doing today your girl is doing great it is december your girl is just i'm just living for this time of the year this is my favorite time of the year like no joke but it is 6 14 and i'm about to head out the door because i need to go to walmart and pick up a few things i'm out of tissue i need some more dryer sheets and tomorrow is wearing like a christmas shirt to uh, school day and it has to have like some kind of writing on it I'm trying to decide if i want to buy one or just skip tomorrow we'll see but i'm gonna see what i can find at walmart if i can't find anything i like or if i can't find something for a decent price we just not gonna have one, okay? But yeah, I just wanted to come on and introduce the vlog, say what's up, how y'all doing, check in with y'all, you know. But we're about to head out this door. And also, I'm so freaking hungry. All I've had today was a Pop-Tart. A Pop-Tart, y'all. So uh, let's go and see what we can get into. Last year I thought about how things can So it's definitely been about two days since the last time we spoke. <laughs> I, I was supposed to go to Walmart, I think, the last time I talked to y'all. And I ended up not feeling like it at all. I left the house, got to Walmart, pulled in the parking lot, and I was like, no, ma'am. So we ended up getting, like, KFC and coming straight home. So, yeah. But I just washed my face with my turmeric and kojic acid bar. If you watched the last vlog, then you know that I'm trying to get rid of this hyperpigmentation, baby. So we're doing what we got to do. But it is currently... 918 y'all let that stuff on my face for 30 minutes this time and it didn't do nothing like it didn't burn or anything but again i don't have sensitive skin so don't don't take it from me telling you to do that so yeah but it's late and i need to get ready for bed tomorrow is friday thank the lord oh yeah i was dang near about to fall asleep at work the other day i'm so tired i just need to relax and i'm gonna go look at another place to get married like another venue tomorrow and i'm really excited because y'all i'm just honestly ready for this to be done i thought i found a place but things happened and I didn't end up going with it. But I think I found the one that I'm going to use. And we're going to go see it tomorrow and I'm really excited. I probably won't show y'all, especially if I end up picking it. But y'all will see it eventually. Also, I need my freaking hair retwisted. Like, it's starting to look bad. And it's definitely, it's definitely been a month. Time to get another retwist. I'm trying to decide though, do I want it now? Or do I want to wait closer to my birthday? Because my birthday is January 2nd and it's only December 7th. So I feel like it'll be too soon to get another retwist before my birthday if I get one now, you know? So, but I gotta have one before Christmas. I don't know, I'm struggling. But I'm gonna go to bed and I'll talk to y'all tomorrow. Hey y'all, good Friday morning. Your girl is so happy today because it is the last day of the week, which means I only have one week and a half yeah i have a week and a half left of school and then i am on christmas break so i'm so happy about that i am exhausted this morning and i made the mistake of coming home yesterday and falling asleep for like two three hours and then you know how to make myself go to sleep that night so i was struggling today is also the mom breakfast which i feel like we have a breakfast like with moms or dads at least every other week like i feel like we just have one of these and here it is again so thankfully i have to be here earlier this year than i did last year because when i would get here last year there would be no freaking parking because of all the parents here to eat with the kids like annoying i would literally pull my butt on top like you know y'all i drive a big old a big old chevy okay i would pull my butt up on top of the grass and i would park right there all day because i'm like who i'm not walking mm -hmm. if it's not if it if i can't see the front door i'm not walking okay i'm not doing it and it's cold out here right now no ma'am i would park my butt on the grass but thankfully again since i work earlier now i get a parking spot i get my parking spot because this is where i park every morning but i'm about to get ready to go inside it is currently 7 41 i usually have to clock in by 7 45 so we need to get out the car and i'm so excited which i told y'all last night but i'm going to go look at another place for our wedding and i am so freaking excited about it because honestly I just, i'm just ready to book something i'm so sick of looking at places it's crazy like i knew that weddings and getting married and all could be like stressful and overwhelming and all that but y'all it's really just picking the freaking venue you can't really do anything until you have a place to get married at i can't give people dates i can't send out invitations i can't plan a bachelorette or anything until i have a freaking place because I, my date's not 100 percent secured until i actually know where it's gonna be at and they say yeah it's available you got it so yeah i'm excited to say the least people are starting to pull in so i think that's my cue to get out the only thing i like about these breakfasts with like moms and dads in the morning is that they end up having like a hell of a lot of biscuits left like 
there's so many like <laughs> sausage biscuits from McDonald's left over and your girl be going in. That's, I don't eat on purpose on the mornings we have these. Yeah, y'all. I will see y'all when I get out of work. I'm leaving uh, just a tad bit early today just so I can make it to my appointment on time. Hopefully everything goes how it needs to go. Hey y'all, what's up? It is late at night. What time is it, babe? 6.58. Oh, I said, it's, I said it's late at night. It's only 6.58. But I'm about to get ready because we're going to Andrew's friend's birthday dinner. I mean, not dinner. Goodness, I cannot get it together. He's having a party and we're going to it. I'm tired, but he always show up for us and Andrew, so I'm gonna go. But yeah, I need to get ready. Um, my makeup is kind of all over the place. I kind of took a nap when I got off work, so I look crazy. But it's okay, we're about to fix that real quick. Boom, y'all like that transition? <laughs> that was Bae's idea. <laughs> but my makeup is done again. It was just a little touch up. Like I already had makeup on. I just kind of, you know, done a little sup sup to it. But now I gotta get dressed and we gonna go. Bae bought me a new chair, y'all. He surprised me today. My early Christmas gift, cause the chair I'm sitting in is like old chair that he's had like before we even got together. So I've had, I've been sitting in this chair for a long time. But he surprised me with a new one. It's a pink, what's it called? Pink velvet office chair and it has gold details. It, gold detailing which is what i wanted and it's really cute and i can't wait to set it up but i'm not setting it up right now because we gotta go but i probably will set it up tonight or yeah i'll probably set it up tonight but i am freaking hungry there's gonna be food thank goodness um he said like some wings and rotel and whatnot i'll try to record a little something something while we're there can't even promise y'all but i'm gonna try to get a little something, something i hate that i sound so congested congested i cannot talk today and don't mind me i'm just covering up my gray hair <laughs> with eyeliner but yeah i'm gonna go get dressed and then i will see y'all probably in the car all the way there i don't know i'll see y'all in a bit all right y'all so we are in the car clearly and we are about to be at the place we're literally like five minutes away so i just want to come in and say hey <laughs> finally decided on something to wear that's what took us so long to leave the house because i could not figure it out i did not know what i wanted to put on i done changed like four or five times but we got it together but i'm excited i'm so hungry that's what i'm most excited for because he having some wings and all that y'all i'm so hungry i cannot can't think of anything else but some food. We are literally arriving at the place an hour and five minutes late. <laughs> but it's okay. We don't need to be right on time. You know, nobody gets to a party on time. I don't even know if y'all can see him. My light is so bright. But yeah, y'all, we about to be there. So I'll see y'all when we get inside. I can't let him take my soul. Nah, 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 no. Oh, I can't let him take my soul. Nah, 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 no. Oh yeah, they done, baby. They done. They done. But he hit the fan when I got him down and pinched. But I took a break, I had to leave and go get cleansed. God forgive me for all my sins. I can't say these. Happy birthday to you. Thank y'all. Woo! Yeah. Better watch your soul, cause you know they trying to get it. Yeah, yeah. Hey y'all, so it's the next day. We had a great time last night at Andrew's friend's birthday party. We didn't get home until a little bit after midnight, but we, again, still had a great time. It is 2.26 and we are headed to my Memo Betty's 93rd birthday party today. So birthday party back to back, you know. But she is turning 93 today, y'all. 90. Three. That is such a blessing because who you know makes it that long. You know, she's been through so many different generations and eras. It's crazy. But that is the definition of a blessed woman right there. She definitely is. But we are headed there now. We should be there in like three minutes. So I will see y'all once we get to the party. You gonna say hey to the vlog, babe? What's going on? His head is hurting, y'all. He done he done went a little too hard last night. <laughs> yeah, Y'all Andrew over here talking junk because we're throwing my 93-year-old grandmother a surprise party. He don't think it's a good idea to throw her a surprise party with her age. I don't think so. But listen, y'all, she do not act like she's 93. She literally acts like she, this woman is still driving, getting around wherever. Whenever she need to go somewhere, she get in her car and go. She is like, she still act like she's 65, 70, y'all. I'm telling y'all, she do not seem like she's 93. But Andrew thinks it's a bad idea to surprise her. <laughs> It'll be all right. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday.
Let's pray. Father, we thank you so very much for this wonderful young lady. We ask that you bless her today in a special way. And we thank you, Father, for 93 years of service to you and reclaiming another 50 years in Jesus' name. Amen. We ask your blessings in the name of Jesus. Amen. 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 Why you don't want to put it on Facebook? I don't want it on that. All right. <laughs> It's a video. <laughs> All right, y'all. So we are back from the party. It's actually been quite some time. Some hours have passed, but I just wanted to come on and end the vlog. We had such a great time at my baby Betty's 93rd birthday. Again, extremely blessed woman, and we are extremely blessed to have her in our lives still. Y'all, she still be getting around. She, she, she don't know that she's 93. <laughs> But it is currently 1024 and we are about to have a little movie night, eat some pizza and some cookies and just chill out for the rest of the night. So I hope y'all enjoyed this video. If you did, please be sure to give it a big thumbs up and also do not forget to subscribe to your girl's channel if you haven't already, okay? I love you guys so, so, so very much and I'll see you in the next video. Bye. Uh -huh.